I am hungry and it is a good thing because there are some tasty treats in front of me. Joining me now is Lisa Malin, Japanese exchange, Japan Exchange Teaching Program Alumni Association Vice President. Wow, that was amazing. How's it going? <laughs> Great. Okay, before we talk a little bit about the food that you've brought in and the Japanese festival, can you tell me about the Japan Exchange Teaching Program? Um, well, it's been going on for over 20 years mm -hmm. and uh, Canadians have been going to Japan to teach English and work as interpreters and translators. And uh, I had the opportunity to go a couple years ago. I was in Chiba City, just outside of Tokyo. Mm -hmm. And the experience was so wonderful. I came back and I found a whole bunch of other alumni. And we've been organizing events every month. And this is our biggest event, the mm -hmm. Summer Festival. And we want to bring a little bit of Japan to everyone in Ottawa. Right. And how has that changed your view of the festival, I suppose, having actually experienced Japan firsthand? Well, these, I picked these up uh, actually last time I went to Japan. <gasps> they're authentic? <laughs> I got them in Japan. <laughs> they're perfect for summer. Mm -hmm. um, they're kind of like pajamas, I guess. And they're mostly kids wear them, men wear them. And kimonos are really, really heavy and hot mm -hmm. to wear in the summer. So they have yukata, which is cotton and lighter. But they're hard to walk in. But this, you know, if you're organizing a festival, you can run around and... and uh, make hot dogs and do whatever you need to do. And these are called Jimbei, right? Excellent. And what we had Kurt wearing earlier was a happy? Yes. Excellent. Yes, they're very comfortable. I might not change back into my other outfit, to be honest with you. All right, before we run out of time, let's talk about the Japanese festival. What uh, dates is it running? It's, uh, it's on Saturday at mm -hmm. Vincent Massey Park. Okay. It'll start at 11 o'clock. Um, ambassador Ishikawa, the Japanese ambassador, will be there to open the festival. Nice. We're super lucky to have him. And we'll have cultural demonstrations all day. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll have martial arts. We have shamisen. Uh, it's a three-string Japanese uh, instrument. It is the sound is incredible. Mm -hmm. um, we also have taiko drumming with the huge drums. Um, they'll be opening the festival as well. Mm -hmm. And we have a group coming in from Montreal actually to do folk dancing. Oh, great. Yeah. Okay, so there'll be a little bit of everything. A little bit of everything. We have kids' tables all day. Everyone. We have 500 hot dogs. Uh, everyone gets one free hot dog. In this case, I get three free hot dogs. <laughs> what, are we, what are we putting on top of them? Well, this one, I grated some uh, daikon radish. So it's big, white, icicle radish. Mm -hmm. And uh, has a little bit of uh, soy sauce and green onions. Yes. And we have sautéed caramelized onions with uh, teriyaki sauce. That's what these are? That's what this is here. Yeah. All right. Let's do that in the center one. Perfect. OK. This one's, I think, my favorite. It is delicious. All right, so we've got the sautéed onions on there. Excellent, and I have a mix some uh, Japanese mayonnaise with wasabi sauce. <laughs> <laughs> like a creamy wasabi. Let's get so so I can do this. Ta -da. Okay, and, and on the last one? You top it off with uh, nori. Okay. Nori? Yeah, it's Is seaweed. It's, it's a seaweed, okay. Mm -hmm. So you get it on your sushi and your maki. All right. Wow, you're good at this. <laughs> Fantastic. I may have had a little bit of experience with chopsticks before. I love, 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 love any type of Asian cuisine. And last? And last? Okay, so this is a sautéed uh, cabbage, mm -hmm. also with some teriyaki sauce. Excellent. And what's on the far left here? This is, these are bonito flakes. So anytime <clears throat> we make a broth for soup, like a miso soup, you mm -hmm. need to have some kind of uh, way to get the broth. So it's also really tasty to have on top. It's a different texture. There we are. And then, of course, our wasabi mayonnaise needs to go on here. Yes. So, Kurt, before I bite into it, would you like the cabbage, the sautéed onion, or the, what's the last one? This one is the radish one. The radish. What are you thinking? Far right, far left? Ladies' choice. Doesn't matter to me. I like them all. Ladies' choice. OK. Yeah. Well, this lady here chooses all three. <laughs> Okay. Three for three. Be three for three. By the way, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Um, what's the the cost? Is there any price? No, it's totally free. We have wonderful support from all the Japanese local organizations, uh, the Ottawa Japan Community Association, the Canada Japan Community Association, and from Bonsai. All these wonderful people are going to come out. Everyone's doing everything for free, so we'd love to have as many people come out as possible. Okay. We had 
Yeah, 500 hot dogs. So the first 500 people there will get a hot dogs. Perfect. And where is it taking place? Vincent Massey Park. Vincent Massey Park. Okay, well, I thank you very much for coming in this yeah. morning, Lisa. It was a pleasure to meet you. I thank, for the, thank you for the use of your authentic gym buy. The elasticized waistband is going to be <laughs> ideal, considering how much food I'm about to eat this morning.